Four months ago, Pokemon Legends ZA was announced, and now that I have some free time to make this video, I'd like to present my hopes and predictions for Pokemon Legends ZA. We know this game will be set in Kalos and also take place entirely within Lumio City, which is currently under an urban redevelopment plan which you are helping with. We also can assume that Zygarde, AZ, or both will most likely have big importance in this story. Now on to my hopes and predictions. This section will be split into four parts, being Pokemon, story, characters, and miscellaneous stuff. But let's start first off with miscellaneous. I believe the release date of this game will be around January or February on a Friday based on Legends Arceus' release. I believe that the most likely days would either be January 24th, January 31st, or February 7th. I believe this game will also be single player, with no online play with other players like Legends Arceus, meaning that the linking cord would be added as well for trade evolutions. The physics would be basically entirely the same as Legends Arceus. The only change I could see are with ride Pokemon. Maybe we have like different Pokemon like a Rhydon or something. Next, we will go on to characters, which I assume that there will be many ancestors of people from Kalos in this game, of course, but also some people from Unova, Paldea, and Galar. Now, this will be huge if this is right. I believe that Emmet will appear in Legends ZA, being traveled to the past like Ingo, but like to a different dimension, so that in the next Legends game, which will be based in Gen 5, they will meet and be reunited. It will be a happy ending for them, and maybe they can have like some effects on like Gen 5 future, like they made the battle sub, boy, maybe. Next will be story. I believe this game will be only set in the past and not just the future or a mix between them. Like in Legends Arceus, I believe that the player will be sent to the past from the present, but instead of Arceus doing this, I believe that either the ultimate weapon or AZ's Fluette will cause this to happen. The goal of the game, like I said in the basically confirmed stuff, is to develop Lumio City to something similar seen in the trailer or in Pokemon X and Y. Finally, we're at the main course, the Pokemon. I believe that every Pokemon or almost every Pokemon from the Kalos games will be in Legends EA. The only ones I cannot see are like some of the Legends, like Mewtwo and the Kanto Birds. I also believe that every Pokemon in the Oras games that had Megas will be in the game as their normal forms. The Gen 1, 3, and 6 starters will be obtainable outside of being actual starters for Legends ZA, like the Sinnoh starters in Legends Arceus. I also believe that the starters for this game would be Snivy, Pipplup, and Scorbunny, for the main regions of either French style origin or soccer. I also believe that all of the starters will get regional form and mega forms for their final evolutions. Any mega forms added will be of Pokemon that weren't in any of the Gen 6 games, which include XY and Oras. The only way I could see these Pokemon get new forms is if they got a regional form or evolution. I think some Paldea Pokemon will also be in this game because of the close proximity of Paldea and Kalos. I also think some Pokemon that should get new forms, whether regional, mega, or evolutions, would be Tinkaton, Mousehold, Thievul, Double, Bolton, Flygon, Ladian, and Dragonite. I am so confident of this, I'm putting 99%. I believe the Swords of Justice, Cobalion, Terrakion, Virizion, and Keldeo will be in this game, because according to Bulbapedia, they are loosely based on the titular group of main characters from the French novel The Three Musketeers, and the forces of nature who appeared in Legends Arceus are from Unova, like the Swords of Justice. And the forces of nature have more Japanese-style origin, it all makes sense. One more Pokemon I would actually really like to see would be a new Eeveelution. It might be unlikely, but since Kalos was the last game and Eeveelution was introduced, and a Dragon-type would be perfect Eeveelution, especially with Sylveon, having a Dragon-type Eeveelution which would evolve with something very rare like maybe a Zygarde scale would be really cool. Or maybe have like some lore implications, like Sylveon's made the like Dragon-type Eeveelution extinct, that would be interesting. Finally, I believe that Zygarde, Xerneas, and Yveltal will get a new form of some kind, like a Mega or maybe like a complete form, which would be like super powerful. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please consider to like and subscribe. It's free, supports me, and tells me what you like. Also, if you have any thoughts of your own that you would like to say, consider leaving a comment. I hope you guys have a great day, and see you later.